how many battles you fought or what you did. Not, not important as much as friends and family. The humility of Army veteran James Gillis belies the courage it took for him to survive the legendary Battle of the Bulge during World War II. He was a battery clerk with the 590th Field Artillery Battalion, 106th Division. Wounded by shrapnel in the back and leg, he fought until he ran out of ammunition and was a prisoner in Germany for several months. I spent time in boxcars. I spent time walking on with a brace on my right foot. And uh, I spent time seeing my friends being killed. Gillis often goes silent when recalling those dark days, the torture, the threats. He was just 98 pounds when liberated, having learned a valuable lesson that he'll share with anybody who asks him. I guess to live each day, regardless of what's happening, I think that's the most important thing you can do. Be honest with yourself and your friends. That's important to me. Jim, in the love of his life, Elaine, had 73 years of marriage before her passing a couple of years ago. They raised three children, six grandchildren, and 11 great-grandchildren. Many of them gathered this summer to celebrate his 100th birthday. Cousins that have traveled from California, from Florida to North Carolina, to Pennsylvania, did I get them all? And family from Illinois and Minnesota, and extended family, as well as neighbors and friends. And it's just friends that have known my father for decades. Uh, family is the only thing for me. Not the only thing, but the most important thing. Always has been, always will be.